When big names in the music business eat out, they come to restaurants like Ma Maison here in Beverly Hills. But what happens when they go on tour? Hi, I'm Maria Shriver behind the scenes in Hollywood, and tonight we're going to show you how the stars keep from starving when they're on the road. This woman's job is making sure that stars like Donna Summer, Billy Joel, and Kenny Rogers get a little taste of home cooking when they're on those long nationwide tours. Her name is Mitch Truby, and she's not your typical caterer. Her Florida-based operation called Personal Touch is really a kitchen on wheels. Mitch got into this line of work a few years back when a Florida civic group asked her to look after visiting author Sylvia Porter. She quickly discovered that there was a real need for her culinary talents on the road, traveling with the stars. The more I um, checked into it, the worse I found that it was. That everything is, even though they had their own managers and things, but when they get to town, a lot of times it's very helter-skelter. You're running around like chickens with your heads cut off, and, and, and it can be kind of bad. And the thing that hit the most was the fact that I will cook your home-cooked dinner. I'll fix you whatever you want. I need to um, get about five or six grocery carts. Where would you like for me to put them? Just put them right out here, Alva. You sure? You won't let anybody roll away? No. Okay, which way's the beer? On this day, Midge is traveling with Kenny Rogers. This stop is Wichita, Kansas, the fourth city on a 24-city tour. She says that part of the challenge is just finding a grocery store that can provide the food she needs in both variety and volume. My family could eat off of it for, um, for almost a week, I would say. But you know, but I've got, you have 30 men, you know, and 30 men that work real hard. They spend a lot of time, you know, working, lifting, toting a lot of heavy stuff. Groceries for this day ran $562.60. And she says she'll have to do it all over again tomorrow. When you're working, you know, 16, 17 hour work days together, that, you know, you become a family. And they call me mom when you are the cook. You know, a lot of times they, they'll think of you that way. On this tour, Midge's cooking has made a believer out of Leland Rogers, Kenny Rogers' brother and agent. We have home-cooked meals every night regardless of where we're at, just as though we were at home. Mm -hmm. That's a lot better. Kenny likes just about anything. Um, he likes chicken and fish the best. Um, and he likes banana pudding. Donna Summer liked Italian, and I cooked Italian for her. It was requested that she want Italian dinner. Billy Joel also likes, uh, he likes Italian food and Mexican food. We, we did Italian for them and all those boys are from New York. And they said, well, if this passes the test. And the next thing I know is Bill's running up the steps and he says, hey, I hear it's great. And it's great. Okay. I'm one of her biggest fans. Tonight we'll have black eyed peas and I hope she cooked enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> It's the nature of the music business that performers end up spending a whole lot more time in their tour buses than in their fancy cars. But thanks to traveling chefs like Midge, the long days on the road are now a whole lot more appetizing.